Welcome to my channel where you find all about mixed media, art journaling, assemblage and anything else that sparks my interest. Hi, my name is Bea Grob and I'm glad you are here today. Hey folks! Today we're gonna look at uh, art journals. No, not all of them. <laughs> Just the top one, which I have finished. Those I have shown you right, right now, uh, they are all finished art journals. I have back here more journals, work in progress, so to speak. Um, I have them from really small to semi-larger ones. I do have plans for next year or an, an even bigger one. We'll see how that works. I'm not sure yet. I do have like the store bought, that's a Dino Wakely I think, or it's it, at least from Ranger, that's what I'm sure. But I also have like junk journal, so I do all kind of journals, now you haven't seen it really, so, so I do have a variety of odd journals. But what I really like the most is working on those pages that uh, still has to be bound into a book, haven't done it yet. Anyway, uh, now I'm gonna head down to the table and we're gonna do a flip through the one I have recently finished. Uh, it start, it, I call it a starter journal. I st it started as loose pages where I did paint all the background. Like here I did the background, I did half of the pages or better one side of the page I did as a watercolor background and the other part I did play with acrylic paints. So while I'm showing you those art journal which is by the way about 14 by 40 centimeters or five and a half by five and a half inches, I'm gonna talk about what I have planned for the future like for 2020 or what I do in the next few weeks. So uh, next project, while I'm filming this, uh, I'm ready to get to my really big show. I do organize together with a lot of volunteers with about 55 arts and art crafts people in Uster. And then my next project will be uh, around the 7th of November. I do attend a consumer show where I, I gonna do little workshops there so if you are inclined to do some workshops and if you are in Zurich there is the consumer show Creativa which is all about art and craft or craft and art more to be seriously it's more craft and art nothing against craft just to be, it's not a fine art thingy Anyway, I will be there and will teach workshops about uh, making little journals, something like that. They gonna do with jelly print, obviously, the front and back cover, and they're gonna bind it in a very simple journal. It's just about an hour, so if you are interested in that, that's maybe something for you. That's what I have left over for this year. Besides my usual YouTube of course and my usual painting and doodling and drawing and all that stuff. I have planned to do a new thing and I call it mixed media methodology on Mondays. So I will have every Monday a video in real time most of the part. The thing with YouTube you have to squeeze it in like preferably like 10 minutes, which I think is absolutely not possible with what kind of things I do. Uh, or then about 20 minutes. Still I feel sometimes I can't show everything and I can't tell about every little trick I have. So I decided I'm going to do a um, paid membership. It's going to be over at Teachable. So you get every week uh, real t mostly real-time videos I mean obviously things like cutting out fuzzy cutting that's not something you 
need to watch completely but sometimes I would like to show a little bit more what I do more close-ups probably to always with two cameras uh, just or giving more hints how I choose my things it's just not always possible in those 10 10 to 20 minute videos that's why I decided uh, I'm gonna do that and it's gonna be weekly videos it's gonna be a monthly mood board I do a lot of photography and I sometimes pick the colors from the photos so things like that and I also gonna include collage sheets which gonna be downloadable downloadable as PDF sorry I'm filming early in the morning not my usually time but my schedule right now is so tense that I have to do it whatever I can that means I have to cut back on some other stuff well some of you know I'm in design teams I have been in design teams since a while but I decided to cut back not because I don't like the, their products or I don't like the people it's just I only have 25 hours a day or something like that so I have to make some sacrifice <laughs> so I decided for 2020 I don't do any design team projects we'll see how it works um, um, sometimes very spontaneously I still gonna work with their products and I still gonna have from time to time something for them to share but I don't can't commit no longer like usually you have to have like twice a month projects and if you are in several design times that adds up so uh, that's the one thing I gonna cut back the design team I don't like her <laughs> Um, but the other thing is also with YouTube I'm not sure yet if I can keep up also with twice a week videos so it may be or maybe not I really don't know that I stop having twice a week a video just once a week once a week I always gonna have so I just don't know yet what I gonna do so and um, yes there will be promotion for this video as soon as I'm up there's gonna, you're gonna see things like that you're gonna see other things also we're gonna work with all kind of things we're gonna work with fabric we're gonna work with papers and paint and that's by the way you can see it but this piece is a fabric piece here you probably can see it a little bit better it's a fabric piece too so we're going to work with all kinds of materials and if there are enough people I also going to do a Facebook group, a private closed Facebook group just for those from this, uh, I call it 4M, Mixed Media Methodology on Mondays. So where I'm going to do Facebook Live, so yeah, that's what I have planned so far. And that's that kind of collage sheet you can expect. I mean, there are going to be faces from me, there are going to be just backgrounds, uh, there's going to be a lot of things. Oh, I didn't do that backside. So, that's what you're going to see coming up in 2020. And by the way, let me know if you want to see those art journals too. I hope to see you soon again. In the meantime, take care.